the truth about sugar, how it affects your body beyond calories. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Talk Health. Today, we're diving deep into a topic that's on almost everyone's plate, sugar. We all know sugar can be sweet, but there's so much more to it than meets the taste buds. In this episode, we're exploring the lesser-known impacts of sugar on our bodies beyond just calories. So, let's get started. Have you ever wondered if sugar is secretly affecting your body in ways you didn't even realize beyond just those pesky calories? Post. Now, we're all aware that excessive sugar consumption can lead to weight gain and dental issues, but did you know that sugar can also wreak havoc on your skin? High sugar intake triggers a process called glycation, which damages collagen and elastin, leading to premature aging and wrinkling. Beyond skin concerns, let's talk about its effect on our mood. Studies suggest a link between high sugar intake and increased risk of depression and anxiety. That sweet treat might give us a quick mood boost, but the subsequent crash can leave us feeling low and irritable. But that's not all. Sugar's impact on the liver is quite alarming. Excessive sugar consumption can lead to 1. A condition called non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, which is when your liver accumulates fat potentially leading to inflammation and more severe health issues down the line. 2. Liver function, impairment. 3. Fructose metabolism. 4. Lipid accumulation, inflammation. 5. Oxidative stress. and 6. Increased risk of metabolic syndrome. So, what can you do to manage your sugar intake? It's time for a conscious change. Start by reading nutrition labels and ingredient lists. Reading ingredient labels and nutrition facts on labels is essential for making informed food choices. Look out for hidden sugars under names like high fructose corn syrup, corn syrup, agave nectar, dextrose, fructose, glucose, lactose, maltose, sucrose, cane sugar, brown rice syrup, honey, maple syrup, molasses, fruit juice concentrate. Among these, some are more harmful than others due to their potential impact on health. High fructose corn syrup, for instance, has been linked to obesity and metabolic issues. Agave nectar, while touted as a healthier alternative, is high in fructose and can contribute to insulin resistance over time. Added sugars, regardless of their form, can have negative effects on health when consumed in excess. They can lead to weight gain, dental problems, and an increased risk of chronic conditions such as type 2 diabetes, heart disease, cancer, and non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. It's important to read ingredient labels and nutrition facts to identify and moderate your intake of added sugars, regardless of the specific name they go by. How to read the ingredients nutrition labels. 1. Check the serving size. The serving size is usually displayed at the top of the nutrition facts panel. This information is crucial because all the nutritional values provided on the label are based on this specific serving size. Make sure to compare the serving size to the amount you actually eat to accurately assess the nutritional content. 2. Calories. The number of calories listed per serving gives you an idea of the energy content in that portion of food. This information is useful for managing your calorie intake and making decisions based on your energy needs. 3. Nutrient Content Pay attention to the quantities of fats, including saturated and trans fats, carbohydrates, including dietary fiber and sugars, and proteins. Aim for foods that are higher in dietary fiber and protein and lower in unhealthy fats and added sugars. 4. Percent daily value. The percent daily value, percent DV, represents how much a nutrient in a serving of the food contributes to a daily diet. It's based on a daily intake of 2,000 calories, which is the general standard used for nutrition labels. Example, if a food has 10% DV of fiber, for instance, that means one serving provides 10% of the daily recommended intake of fiber. This percentage can help you quickly assess the nutritional significance of the food. Generally, 5% or less is considered low and 20% or more is considered high. Use this to gauge whether the food is high or low in a particular nutrient. 5. Ingredients List The ingredients list provides valuable information about what's in the product. Ingredients are listed in descending order by weight, so the first ingredient is the most abundant, and the last ingredient is the least abundant. If you see sugar or its various aliases, 
like the hidden names mentioned earlier, listed near the top, it might indicate a high sugar content. 6. Allergens If you have allergies or sensitivities, check the allergen information on the label. Common allergens like wheat, soy, nuts, and dairy should be clearly indicated. This helps you avoid potential health risks related to allergens. 7. Avoid unpronounceable or unfamiliar ingredients. Long lists of complex or unfamiliar ingredients might suggest that the product is heavily processed. Look for foods with ingredients that you recognize and understand, as this generally indicates a more whole and less processed option. 8. Be mindful of claims. Labels often have claims like low fat, reduced sugar, or high in fiber. While these claims can be useful, they can also be misleading. Always double check the actual nutritional values in the panel to ensure the claim aligns with your dietary goals. 9. Compare products. When choosing between similar products, compare the nutrition facts to see which one meets your health needs better. Lower amounts of saturated fats, added sugars, and sodium are healthier choices. Remember, the goal is to choose foods that align with your health goals. By understanding ingredient labels and nutrition facts, you're equipped to make informed decisions about what you're putting into your body. Let's take control of our sugar consumption together. Tips for improving sugar intake. Here are a few tips to help you on your journey. Opt for whole fruits instead of sugary snacks. They contain natural sugars and other nutrients. Choose plain yogurt over flavored ones. You can add fresh fruits or honey for sweetness. Experiment with spices like cinnamon and nutmeg to add flavor without adding sugar. Try to limit sugary drinks. Water, herbal teas, and infused water are better alternatives. And that's a wrap on today's episode of Let's Talk Health. I hope this episode has empowered you with knowledge to make healthier choices. So let's keep the conversation going in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on our future discussions. Until next time, take care and prioritize your health.